I changed him to be strong and useful. Today my name is Codemaster. As Malcolm, <laughs> as Malcolm, I was the I was the boy adopted by the wolf pack. I would have to be to be taught the laws and the customs of the pack before I become I could become a member. Today I'm a young boy interested. Our Cub Scouts promise was similar to what it is today. I promise to do my best to do my duty to guide my country. I do help other people the, and the, obey the law of the path. The two fingers stood for the two ears of a wolf, ready to listen to Aquila's word. Today, it stands for two parts of the promise, to help other people and to obey. Things were looking promising for the Cub Scouts, but the young men who might have been Cub Masters were all in the armed services as 1916 was in the middle of World War I. So, to cope with all the boys that wanted to be wolf cubs, women became leaders, and this is still true today. Even though February 8, 1910 marks the birth of Boy Scouting in America, Cub Scouting did not come to be until 1930. And just as the Scout movement has spread, so too has Cub Scouting. This year, as we celebrate Cub Scouts of America's 55th birthday, 115 countries will be celebrating their individual Cub Scouting birthday. Thank you.